5 Billion Dollar Marketing Lessons from Red Bull Hello and welcome back to 10 Focus. Before we start, hit that red subscribe button so that you never miss out on any of our videos. The number of consumer goods companies that have emerged in the last decade is staggering. There are hundreds of new consumer brands in every industry and category across product lines and price ranges. One of the most significant issues these customer goods companies face is finding the right way to reach their target audience. Brand recognition is an important issue that these companies must find innovative ways of dealing with. The marketing strategies implemented by Red Bull have lent them an advantage in this regard. In this video, we will be looking at some of the marketing lessons we must learn from Red Bull. Red Bull produces one of the most popular energy drinks on the market today. Their brand name is well known, and their logo is recognizable everywhere. This widespread brand recognition has been built over time through strategic marketing efforts and approaches. Getting your product to be top of mind is critical to success, as it gives consumers more brand recognition than other brands they may not use or even be aware of, so they are more likely to choose your product over others when they go shopping. The approach used by Red Bull when building their brand was to make themselves top of mind with consumers first and then launch their marketing campaigns later. This strategy helped them understand who they were selling to, which products they liked best, how they consume these products, what times of day they preferred to purchase them at, and much more. Let us have a look at the things which has helped Red Bull to be the top brand all over the world. Keeping customers at the center How do you think the Red Bull brand managed to come out of nowhere and create such a strong presence? It is important to note that this brand was launched not too long ago in 1987. It is also important to remember that the company is based in Austria. Given that, it is difficult to believe that this brand could have made its way into so many hearts in such a short time. I think Red Bull's success lies in its ability to speak the language of youth. I know you might be thinking that creating a beverage for young people has been done over and over again before, but several factors make Red Bull different from those youth brands you have seen before. First of all, it did not just simply slap on a picture of an attractive model or a hip celebrity on its cans or bottles. The company instead went further by tapping into the youth subculture market. It identified a specific group of people, adrenaline junkies who need something to give them energy after participating in their favorite activities like hang gliding, skateboarding, etc. This consumer group is very niche, but they also are very loyal, and they readily identify with anything they see as part of this lifestyle. Perfect Content Marketing Red Bull has been using content as a marketing tool for a long time. Red Bull Media House has an in-house media department that creates all its content and is responsible for creating the content, including print, online, video, and television formats. The company also has a popular YouTube channel that publishes videos related to extreme sports. The company uses content as both a marketing tool and to establish brand credibility. Red Bull is also known for its sponsorship of various events and activities across the globe. Its recent sponsorship of Felix Baumgartner's Space Jump was broadcast live via YouTube and viewed by millions of viewers. The tone is essential in any communication or messaging, whether marketing a product or service or selling your ideas to others. Tone can be conveyed through words, visuals, symbols, and even music. Have you ever noticed that some businesses seem to have the perfect tone in their advertisements? Tone can make an ad more appealing, or it can come off as silly or unprofessional. The tone on Red Bull's website is playful and fun, which makes it more likely for users to engage with the site's content. Using the power of experimental marketing We all know that it's essential to be moored to a brand strategy before experiential marketing. But just as with any other marketing strategy, it's essential to understand what type of experiential event best fits your brand and your target audience. If a client of mine wanted to host an experiential event that was just a way for sales reps to sell more products, I'd tell them, no thanks. The goal of experiential marketing should be engagement and connection, not sales. When planned correctly, these events are long-term drivers for brand awareness, trust, and advocacy. They can improve word-of-mouth marketing, customer service, loyalty, and even lead generation. Experiential marketing comes in many shapes and sizes, but they all follow the same basic principles of engaging and connecting with customers. The key is to plan an event that will get people talking about your brand both before and after the event. For example, Red Bull has created several successful experiential events, including the Flug Tag competition. The Flug Tag is a competition where teams build human-powered flying machines judged on distance traveled during a set time limit, usually two minutes. Experiential marketing brings together several elements that combine to create a memorable, exciting event for both you and your customers. Creativity Your event should be unique and fun. Consider using unusual venues for events or using unique props or themes. Entertainment value. Your event should be enjoyable, engaging, and fun. These events may include competitions, giveaways, games, activities, and more. Conclusion. The things that have helped Red Bull be on the top are numerous. The company is still doing much more experiments in the market which are helping it to be on the top. 
That's all for today's video, so if you loved watching it, make sure to drop a like out there, press the subscribe, and also don't forget to put the notification bell to all so that you never miss any of our updates. That's all for today. I hope you liked the video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel so that you never miss any amazing video from us.